time of year. The Ferris wheel rolling once again at State Fair. New food, new attractions, and making it a summer favorite. But did you ever wonder how did State Fair get its start? Ricky Mitchell learned the history and shares it with us tonight. More than one million people will take in the sights and sounds of State Fair Park this summer. Quite a jump from the 13,000 people who attended the first Wisconsin State Fair in 1851, when admission was just 10 cents. It started in Janesville because they wanted the Illinois people to come up. Kathleen O'Leary, the CEO of the Wisconsin State Fair Park, says the fair originally traveled all over the state before finding a permanent home here in West Dallas in 1892. The Green Bay Packers have played at the Wisconsin State Fair. We had the Wright Brothers fly in the Wisconsin State Fair, which was the mile, the Milwaukee mile. One of the many interesting things about State Fair, the Expo Center, you can find so many unusual things for sale in there. How did that get started? Really, it was a uh, Kind of on the on the lines of an apothecary, I mean, where they kept the traveling vendors, right, that wanted to showcase their wares. So what we know now as infomercials really was the the ground level of those slicers and dicers and those people that can, their theater, their actors, right? What was the most unusual item you found in there? Um, I believe there was somebody selling something that would start on fire in just different colors. You don't really do anything like this in the UK, so it's quite interesting to see everything here. The State Fair has endured the test of time and even bounced back from a smallpox scare in 1894 to become one of the most popular summer attractions in Wisconsin. Reporting at State Fair Park, Ricky Mitchell, today's TMJ4.